So today, most likely, I wouldn't have really been here. For that matter, actually, I probably wouldn't have even been in this room today because almost a decade ago, I nearly died, not once, but twice. And today I'm here to share with all of you the experience of what that made me and how I have adopted a single idea in my life and that idea translated into an identity and I am who I am because of those experiences today. On June 4th, 2010, my husband and I, as just as any expectant parents would be, were super excited to welcome our second child into our house. We packed our bags, got ready, went to the hospital, all ready to get the new baby into this world. A little bit of fear because this was our second child, but we've done it once. How hard it can be for the second time, right? That's what we thought. So I chose to change the only thing that I could change, which was how I thought. I decided I was not going to anymore think about if my husband was going to get married again or who's going to get my daughters married, but instead I was going to think about how I can just get out of this place, into my house, safe and healthy. I kept repeating to myself, I am in on one single idea has personally for me changed how I think, it has changed how I am with others, it has changed my social circumstances, it has changed me physically, it has changed the energy levels and how I feel because I have no other distraction, I'm only thinking about this one thing in every aspect. How can I be resilient? How can I help others become resilient? And what does resilience really mean? I'm only looking at that one aspect of it. Everything else is a distraction to me. Find your one single idea. Discover that idea, stick to that idea. We are all a unique story. Let your unique idea guide that story and you can write your own story, which is beautiful, unique, and it's guided through your idea. Remember, each of you are not a drop in an ocean. You guys are all an ocean by yourself, and you have the ability to be that ocean, unique, just yourself. Let your idea guide you. Thank you very much.